2021. So anyway, I got a call, a call from a new customer, I believe. He's got a, wants me to go service his oil boiler. I do a lot of these around here. Seems like that's pretty much all I do sometimes. It's all good. I'm getting them ready for the winter. I try to get you some shots over there if it's something. Sometimes it, sometimes it can be interesting. They're always something a little different, right? You guys see me do a thousand of them already. How I do it. It's not rocket science, mama. Not rocket science. One quarter mile, turn right, Blanchett Street. They went up like that with it. They put, they put short legs on there. Or he put it on an angle. I wonder why he did that. See how he's got it tipped? Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Getting a little low on the fuel. Yeah, I know, but I know. Like a dumbass, Steve. I'm a dumbass. I says, well, we'll see if it comes down in price. It's gone up 20 cents. Yeah, it's going to go up. You're not going to. I'd get it right away because the colder it gets, it's going to go up more. Yeah, so I'm going, I'm going, to, I'm going to get 150 gallons. Yeah, I would. You should have got it in the summer. I know, buddy. I know, I know. You um, got gas here, too. Yeah, that's for the uh, hot water tank. Wow, look at the old, look at the old lit, uh, aluminum fitting. See it? On the gas pipe? See, that's aluminum. That's scary shit right there. Weird. See, that's an aluminum fitting on a gas pipe. Guaranteed that would leak if we ever did a test on it. See it? The T? Right here. Yeah, it's aluminum. That's, uh, I just... So what we'll do is we'll check the oil flow and we'll see if that filter's dirty. Alright, buddy. Is there, do you need me to help you at all? Nope, I need you to just let me do my job. How's that sound? I get the message. Can I get you a cup of coffee or anything else like that? I'm good. All right. Well, soda, water, you just let me know. Well, they're going to have this ripped apart for a year, I heard, this, I hope this construction. Yeah, because I talked to the guy at the bank. He said it's going to be a year because they're going to go all the way down both both sides of the street. Because everybody's using this street now because it's going to detour. This, ain't a, it, this doesn't go through this street. So everybody's <laughs> using it, right? It's like I've never seen more freaking traffic. It's going to be a year, the guy said, from the bank. Crazy shit, huh? Uh, do you want me to... Oh, you're going to shut this off so it don't come on on you, right? I'm like 50 seconds. Yeah, I'm going to shut it off right now, guy. I mean... Well, if you need some help, I'm here for you. I'm tight. Well, I don't mind if you watch. I mean, you can hang around if you want. I could care less. I mean, that don't bother me. I just want to make sure you're okay, buddy. If, uh, if I'm, if I'm not okay, Tom, you're in big trouble. My buddy Tom Ness says, take care of you. I said, okay, I'll make sure he doesn't work too hard. You're I just ready. did his house. Yeah, that's where you... He says, make sure you say, make sure you help him out if he needs it. I said, okay, Tom. Got an attack dog. I walked by the flipping window. The thing's trying to rip me apart. Oh, really? <laughs> little little flipping ankle he's, biter. He's going to Florida. He's going. He's going to live down there. No, no, he's just going on vacation next week. Oh, he's got. He's doing good, huh? Oh, yeah, he's. Get rid of his office. That's a lot of expense when the people aren't going out there on your offices anymore. So why don't you just you know work from home or something? What do you say to that? He said he's thinking about it instead of having that office. In the yeah, he could probably right work out of home, no? Yeah, absolutely. You know? Why not? All right. If you need to get something or something to job, come back a little while, okay? Okay. Okay, bro. It's been a couple of years since he did the service, so let's we'll see what's going on with it. I want to be carrying my tools. Mm -mm. Go hide them electrodes. Uh, I'm way up. Holy shit, mama. That's crazy. That's going to be revamped for sure. Check the head. Set those way down. How oh, high they are? We'll redo that. So we'll change the nozzle.
set these away off. We'll put them down some. For a nozzle on there. 80. A 90. 80 degree. I'll go to a little 75 in this thing. It's got such a big nozzle on there. Don't need it. It's a small house. Yeah, it's clean. That's good. I'll go with that nozzle. Check out oil flow, see what we're getting for oil flow. And, uh, that filter might still be good at the tank, I'm not sure yet. Gaba. If the thing don't need to be changed, I don't change it, period. Well, I, sell, well, I sell the guy something he don't need. That's just how I am. need a filter we change it but if it's still good we'll leave it alone that's a lot better it's actually down a little bit more than it needs to be but we'll be okay with that fire up a lot better. What happened is it will arc out and come back when it when the air hits it. Putting smaller nozzle down sizing the nozzle down a little bit. It does look a little cookie here. It looks a little like it's cooked in the front. Fried chicken. It's fried chicken, y'all. Looking like fried chicken. Ain't nothing like fried chicken, y'all. this here so when I turn the switch on she should fire let's just get it off somewhere and clean it. Put this as the front. Not rocket science. You can see the plate here for the uh, either the rear or the front. The rear or the top flu for the peelers. Well, not crazy. Be 
close than that, to be honest with you. So you do the best you can with what you got to work with and that's all you can ask for. Check the oil flow here, so we got the oil flow. Put it on purge mode. Put it on purge mode. Those are still fine. I'm gonna put the oil for them. We brushed them back and we brushed them back and then out. New nozzle. We set the electrodes. The rest is gonna get. Okay, new nozzle, brushed down boiler and vacuumed. Good oil flow, okay draft. Reset electrodes, clean burner head. That's the best it's gonna get right there. Wide off here. It's not all full of soot. You can see the front of it's kinda cooked. It's been running kinda. It's not the greatest draft in the world. What are you gonna do? It is what it is. Pressure's fine, feed is not stuck. I don't know if the gauge is reading properly, but that's it, it's as good as it gets. 